Hello students, today we are going to learn about the next topic in chapter 2 that is plasticity characteristics of the soils. Coming to the next topic, it is dealing with the numerical problems based on the liquid limit, plastic limit and shrinkage limit. This is the first problem. A sample of clay which is having the liquid limit and the shrinkage limit of respectively 60% and 25%. If the sample has a volume of 10 ml at the liquid limit and volume of 6.4 ml at the shrinkage limit, we have to determine the specific gravity of the solids that is Gs. Let us consider Ms as a mass of the solids. So what is given in the problem? The mass of the water at the liquid limit is 60%. So we have to consider 0.6 times of Ms and the shrinkage limit 25% that is 0.25 percentage of Ms. So what is the water lost between the liquid limit and the shrinkage limit? We have to sub subtract this both that is 0.6 minus 0.25 times of Ms that is 0.35 ms that is measured in ml but what is the actual reduction given in the problem from the 10 ml to the 6.4 that is 3.6 ml now we have to equate this both to get the value of the ms so the value of ms is uh, uh, calculated as 10.29 gram but what is the mass of the water shrinkage limit 0.25 times the ms substitute the value of the ms we get 2.57 gram but what is the volume given in the shrinkage limit that is 2.57 we have calculated. But what is the volume of soil particles? We have to subtract it from the volume at the shrinkage limit that is 6.4 minus 2.57 that is nothing but 3.83 ml. Again we know uh, specific gravity of the soil is given as ms by v1 into rho w. So what is ms 10.29? We have calculated from the above calculation. V1, uh, V1 is the value of 3.83. What is rho w? Gram per cc, 1 gram per cc into 1. So after calculation, we get it as 2.69. It is a ratio, hence it has no units. What is the second problem? In an expression for the determination of the shrinkage limit, the following observations were taken, like the volume of the saturated soil, mass of the saturated soil, Volume of dry soil after shrinkage, mass of the dry soil after shrinkage. We have to calculate the shrinkage limit and the specific gravity of the soils. From the given data, we have to assume the following. Like uh, volume of saturated soil is taken as V1. This is V1. And what is V2? Volume of dry soil. This is M1 and this is Ms. We already know the formula. To calculate the shrinkage limit, Ws, that is Ms minus M1 minus V1 minus V2 into rho W by Ms. Just substitute all the given values in the problem. This has to be done, rho W. Again, rho W, why it is 1? Because gram per cc. In gram per cc, it is 1 gram per cc. So, Ws is equal to, after calculation, we get it as 11, uh, 0 0.1147. If it is taken in percentage, it is 11.47. To calculate the specific gravity of the solids it is ms by v1 this formula has to be remembered we have already seen in the earlier slides ms by v1 into rho w minus m1 minus ms we have all the values we have to put all the values accordingly and get the value of the specific gravity that is 2.63 again it has no units because numerator and denominator has the same units and they get cancelled thank you